Hello guys. So today I am I am going to give you basic uh, application training regarding to the DFF, which is made by Philips, and this is nothing but Efficia DFM hundred model. Now how to operate this machine basically? See, you can see this is a basic screen of this defibrillator. How to switch on this machine? You can observe this is arrow right. It is on the off mode. That means it is off. You want to make it on first. You have to rotate it on the monitor. It takes some time. To switching on now machine is booting once machine will be boot it will gives you one screen so uh, before it uh, booting I will tell you two things these are nothing but external paddles you can see these are the external paddles of the machine uh, actually with this machine they have provided internal paddle also during live open heart surgery you can use this type of electrodes for the uh, open heart surgery right how to disconnect and connect the paddles you can see this is actually knob to remove the paddles you have to rotate it at clockwise and just push it out right it get removed how to fix it you have to match the arrow you just match the arrow and press it right that means it connected properly how to remove these uh, paddles these are called external paddles see in this way you can remove it okay how to fix it you have to just tilt it a little bit and you can make it fix one more thing this is nothing but adult plus pedantic paddle these are the adult one and how to make it pedantic you can switch you can observe this is a switch you just press it and you just remove this is nothing but your pedantic paddles right so i'm just fixing it these are nothing but some basic uh, protocols regarding to the defib this is nothing but charging switch this is your shock switch these are nothing but different different parameter control switch uh, you can discharge from here also these are so discharging switch now just i will show you one more thing uh, before using this defibrillator uh, daily you have to take one pre-use test you can say that pre-use test of this defibrillator how to check it out see you can observe menu is there right go in the menu right rotate the knob you will observe one other can you observe this order go in order there is operational check go in the operational check run operational check click it now read the things right exit clinical mode no right yes okay sorry you have to make it uh, yes operational check okay now you have to just read the instructions right set up therapy knob to 170 just take it on the 170 just read the instruction and perform the things set up connect ecg cable have you connected ecg cable right so this is the ecg cable you can connect ecg cable here you can observe the this is the knob how it connect see the connection of ecg cable one more thing one minute right now connected ecg cable turn off knob at the 150 press the charge button Now you can observe shock delivered sound. Have you listened sound? Yes. Right. Press and release the synchronous button. Press the synchronous. Miss, you have to just follow the instructions. What are the instructions are display on the? Uh, uh, we can say that uh, on the monitor. Now pass external paddles. Everything has to be passed, pass, pass. It is in green. That means machine is working. Now lead ECG test is under process. And daily early morning you have to follow all this process now after completion of this machine will give you a printout and in the printout everything will be mentioned properly including machine serial number model what type of task battery test right uh, printer test ECG everything will be there if anything fault inside the machine it will also maintain on the print you can observe right this is a EPCR DM 100 serial number right in uh, general system test pass therapy knob pass charge button pass shock button pass audio test pass synchronous button pass therapy delivery test pass external paddles lead ecg test also pass that means this machine is working okay fine you can use it directly for the patient now one more i have to tell you how to uh, replace ecg how to replace 
um, what we can say paper you can observe open switch is here can you observe this is open switch right just open it paper will be out once suppose this paper get finished this is suppose second roll you just put it like this okay always remember this is at the upward direction press it you are installed now after completion of operational check you have to press for this exit operational check it will be on main defibrillator screen sometime what happen there will be a cross mark will be here that means machine will not work right something fault inside the machine that time you have to check basic basic settings of the machine basic uh, accessories of the machine otherwise you call to biomedical department right so this is nothing but basic things regarding to the dfm 100 and one more thing i have to tell this is nothing but one switch right so it have adult as well as pediatric suppose i am going to switch it it will be comes on infant and child can you observe right this is adult and sometime what happen it will be on infant and child machine will not deliver shock more than 50 joule i think so right this is a limitation for adult and child so that time you have to select adult okay these are nothing but alarm this is nothing but mark event this is for the report this is for the print right ठीक है, so this is nothing but basic regarding to the DFM hundred. Thank you. YouTube वाले चाहे video आए, YouTube में जाए, अलग नहीं तो